Russian village where every resident is a tightrope walker. Traversing a high wire may seem like a relatively uncommon ability. However, there's one Russian community where it's a perfectly normal thing to be able to do. In Sovikra 1, a small, secluded village in the southern republic of Dagestan everyone who's physically able can walk on a tightrope in a tradition that's existed for more than 100 years. It's even taught in school to the village children. Even though only 400 people still live in the region, at least 17 tightrope walkers from the area have found fame in circuses due to their impressive aerial abilities. Benjamin Franklin was inducted into the International Swimming Hall of Fame. Benjamin Franklin wasn't only a skilled writer, politician, and scientist, he was also an avid swimmer. Franklin began swimming as a child in Boston, which led to one of his first inventions, oval pleats worn on the hands so he could swim faster. The pressure of the deep sea is so intense that it would crush the bodies of any critter not equipped to withstand it. That's why here in Delia Gigas, a small shrimp-like amphipod adapted to form a layer of aluminum hydroxide gel to cover its exoskeleton, acting as a kind of pressure-resistant armor. The Eiffel Tower was inaugurated the same year Nintendo was founded. You might assume that Paris Eiffel Tower is much older than Nintendo, a company famous for manufacturing popular video game systems. But in reality, the iconic Parisian landmark was inaugurated the very same year that Nintendo was founded, 1889. While the tower was being formally introduced to the public at the World's Fair, a playing card company that would eventually become Nintendo was being launched in Kyoto by Fusajiro Yamauchi. Barbie collection includes more than 15,000 dolls. In 1996, Bettina Dorfman received her first Barbie, a Midge doll in fact. By 1993, she was collecting them seriously. And in the 26 years since, she's managed to get her hands on more than 15,000 different versions of the iconic doll, including a rare original Barbie from 1959. There's a floating rainforest in the sea. When most people think of rainforests, they picture massive jungles filled with trees and critters. However, somewhere in the Sargasso Sea sits the so-called floating rainforest that consists not of dense vegetation on land, but of seaweed underwater. Sargassum marine algae can grow to be the length of a school bus. TV commercial didn't air until the 1940s. On July 1, 1941, the L.A. Dodgers were playing the Philadelphia Phillies in New York at Ebbets Field. And while the game was surely exciting on its own, those who were watching at home on the NBC-owned one now WNBC also saw another exciting historical moment, the very first TV commercial shown in the United States. There is a fish with transparent bones and white blood. There are some pretty extraordinary creatures living down in the deep sea. Take, for instance, the Antarctic blackfin ice fish. Not only does this creature lack scales and have transparent bones, but it's also unique in that it doesn't have red blood cells for transporting oxygen, causing the fish to have a very unique characteristic, white blood. Thanks for watching and please don't forget to subscribe and click on the notification bell for updated videos.